Which of the following can accommodate the most number of electrons? A. A 4f orbital. B. The 3d subshell. C. The second shell. Or D. A 3d orbital. According to Pauli's exclusion principle, no more than two electrons can be assigned to an orbital. Therefore, a 4f orbital can accommodate up to two electrons, and a 3d orbital can accommodate up to two electrons. Any d subshell consists of five orbitals, so a 3d subshell can accommodate a maximum of 10 electrons. Five orbitals times two electrons per orbital equals 10 electrons. The nth shell of an atom consists of n subshells. The second shell has two subshells, 2s, which consists of one orbital, and 2p, which consists of three orbitals. Therefore, the second shell has a total of four orbitals and can accommodate a maximum of eight electrons. Four orbitals times two electrons per orbital equals eight electrons. Therefore, the correct answer is B. Other choices given, the 3D subshell can accommodate the most number of electrons. Here's a review of the rules to help you with this type of question. The nth shell of an atom consists of n subshells and has n squared orbitals. Since a maximum of two electrons can be assigned per orbital, the maximum number of electrons that can be assigned to the nth shell is 2n squared. The first subshell is called the s subshell and it consists of one orbital. The second subshell is called the p subshell and it consists of three orbitals. The third subshell is called the d subshell and it consists of five orbitals. The fourth subshell is called the f subshell and it consists of seven orbitals. In general, the number of orbitals is equal to 2L plus 1, where L is the orbital quantum number. For example, the orbital quantum number for the F subshell is 3. 2 times 3 plus 1 equals 7.